Alright guys, welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. Back to potions class. Keeping one force, one control, one damage spell in your spell set will repair you for most combat scenarios. Rebellion. Rebellion.
Rebellion. Rebellion. Confirm them. Arrest them. Hamora. Rebellion.
How are your assignments coming along? Alright. Let's learn. Oh, let's learn a new spell. I completed your assignments, Professor. Good. You should be ready to learn to pulso. Let's see what you can do. Concentrate. Do not let your mind wander. You've got it now. to see that you seem staunchly determined to mark your spell out. Still at it, I see. Well, repetition can be an excellent teacher. Don't mind if I do. Alohomora. Revelio. Clever? How offensive. Rebellion. Pain, a genius. Happy Possibly. But I'll land on this. Moon. Hello, Mr. Moon. Oh, greetings! Uh, any luck removing some more of those demigods statues? I actually have some moons for you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> The fewer of these statues I see, the better. <laughs> uh, you keep your eye out for others, and I'll teach you more about Alahamora. Where should I look for more demigai statues and moons? All of my uh, usual haunts, which incidentally have now become quite haunting. Uh, here in the castle, in Ogsmead, and believe it or not, in some of the surrounding hamlets. Oh, my tormentor is nothing if not thorough. <laughs> Kept me from all my usual engagements for an eternity now. I'll keep an eye out for more demigod statues and see if I can bring you more moons. 
You are to be commended for your bravery and valor. Especially since they can only be collected at night. Only at night time. Peeves. I'm missing the show here. There he is. Look at me! Oh. Off he went. Go to Hawks.
Complete the tasks I've given you, and then meet me in my classroom to learn Defindo, the severing charm. It's typically used to cut an object, but can be a powerful weapon when needed. Depulsa. Guardian Leviosa. It looks like hop it. It looks like a bag end. Hop it. Or the Lord of the Rings. Come on inside. Oh, watch yourself though. Let's have you leave here alive. You're a rebellion. Can do it, Amke. Scaring all the goblins away. Such a wee bairn gain a thrashing to a troll! Oh, I can't believe it! <laughs> you followed a wee butterfly to a grand treasure, eh? Hello. Oh, hello! Whew. Sorry I'm in a bit of a tizzy. I was just scolding some of the plants for spitting and nipping. I suppose it's my own fault for putting more than four to a tray. By the way, Beatrice Green is the name, but you may address me as Madam Green. Madam Welcome Green. to Dogweed and Death Cap. Oh, uh, mind you don't knock the mandrakes. Oh, if there wasn't the constant demand for antidotes, I wouldn't need to stock so many of the little deers. Except, of course, for curses. And, well, if you've been petrified, then obviously you've come to the right place. <laughs> Mind you don't knock the mandrakes. Oh, if there's an uprooting, you'll be the next one to drop dead, and I'm in no mood for a clear-up. Someone died here. Aye. Fortunate, really, that it was just the one. Now then, how may I help you today? I think I'll just have a look around for now. Very well. Let me know if you see anything you like. What do you have for sale? Let's see. Might get the mandrake one. Mandrake seed. Oh, I'm always thrilled when a young one makes a wise purchase. I can tell you'll go far. You're a force to be reckoned with, aren't you? Scaring all the goblins away. Oh, I'm always thrilled when a young one makes a wise purchase. I can tell you'll go far. Your things will be safe with me, until they're sold. Then you'll have to make do with money. Doors always open. You be sure to stop by soon. Alright, 
but let's let's put on some outfits such a wee bairn being a fracking Are we? Sorry about that, guys, but I'm back. Hello there, nice to see you. Hello, Miss Ryan. I wanted to thank you again for your help with Rookwood and Harlow the day of the troll attack. Serona, please. And I was happy to help. Oh, those two are nothing but trouble. Glad you and your friend were here when they found you. I am too. You were speaking to a goblin here that day. Yes, Lodgog. He's a friend. How can you trust a goblin? I was surprised that you seemed friendly with a goblin. I've known him for years. We met when I was waiting tables here as a student, well before I bought the place. He was cordial enough, but we weren't friends then. His mistrust of wizard kind ran deep. But you're friends now. We are. I hadn't seen him in years when he came in a few months ago. But he recognized me instantly, which is more than I can say for some of my own classmates. Took them a second to realize I was actually a witch, not a wizard. Not all goblins are like Ranrock and his loyalists. Lodgok is as worried as the rest of us about what's been going on. In that case, I'd like to talk with him, about Ranrock in particular. Where might I find him? I assume your interest is to do with the rumors I've heard about Ranrock working with our friend Rookwood. It is. If he's not here, you might find him doing business at the Hog's Head. He's a trusted metal trader. You should mention that we spoke. He can, understandably, be wary of witches and wizards. Even ones as young as you. That said, if you're looking for information on Ranrock to help rein him in, you'll find an ally in Lodgok.
Have you heard what Ranrock and Rookwood are working on together? Not much more than the fact that they seem to have some sort of uneasy alliance. Friendship between wizards and goblins is rare enough, but between those two, they each want something the other has. I can guarantee it. That said, I fear they're like a two-headed serpent. Both will need to be taken down to stop whatever scheme they've been plotting. You seemed unfazed by Rookwood and Harlow the other day. They don't scare you. They're bullies, plain and simple. Never tolerated them in my own life, and certainly won't tolerate them going after my friends. Don't misunderstand me. They're dangerous wizards and shouldn't be trifled with. They should, however, be confronted and reminded, whenever possible, that the rest of us have each other's backs. Thank you, Sirona. If you find Lord Gok, please give him my best. I don't know what you've done to make such powerful enemies, but please, watch your back. All right, let's go find that friendly goblin. Lod Lodge God. Hello. Good to see you outside the castle. You too, Amit. I can't imagine how muggles get by without magic. The hog's head in. Say hi to Lord Chog. Welcome to the Ogs Head. Any empty seat is yours. Hello, Lord Gok. Sorona said I might find you here. She did, did she? Did she send you with news? No, actually, I wanted to speak with you. It's about Ranrock. Now I remember. The three broomsticks. Day of the troll attack. You're the student he's after. I am. And I need to know what he and his loyalists are up to, so I can stay a step ahead. Let's say I did know. Why should I trust you? Perhaps I misjudged you, or Sharona trusts me? Sharona trusts me, and she thought our interests may be aligned. Hmm. Well, if Serona trusts you, very well. I may know of something that could help us both. A way to get Ranrock to confide his plans to me. I'm listening. Years ago, a heinous witch stole a sacred goblin relic. Rumor has it that it now rests in her sarcophagus, in a tomb accessible only by wizard kind. Ranrock and I had a, a falling out a while back. The relic could well repair the chasm between us. I might retrieve the relic. Very well. I'll retrieve the relic if you promise to share Ranrock's plans with me. We will have to trust each other. I, that you will not abscond with the relic, and you, that I'll share what I learn. Gather whatever supplies you may need, and meet me near the witch's tomb. I'm ready. Good. There's no time to lose. What precisely is the relic I'm to retrieve? A valuable heirloom known as the Helmet of Erdgott. The witch considered... ...a collector and purchased the helmet as a trinket. She cared not what pain she caused the goblins. Goblins believe that the rightful owner of any object is its maker, not its purchaser. Wizard kind see things differently. It's a wonder goblins and wizards have ever been able to work together. 
The differences between our kinds are myriad. They seem to be. It may surprise you to know that I do not believe those differences always to be insurmountable. It is the reason I find myself traveling with you to this tomb today. Ah, and there it is. The witch's tomb. Dreadful looking place, isn't it? I wish you luck retrieving the helmet. As a wand carrier, you should have an advantage. Now, before you set off, do you have any questions? Three, so. What about this helmet makes it so special? The helmet of Ertgot is an ancient and storied relic, forged during a time of unity among the goblin clans. It inspired greatness, that is, until it was no longer ours. Then it became something else. A symbol of what has been lost, of all that wizard kind has taken from us. Reclaiming it would mean a great deal to goblin kind and to Ranrock. He would be grateful to me should I return it. It seems Ranrock and Rookwood are conspiring. Why would that be? I had heard this. When the dark-hearted conspire, they seldom make their full intentions clear to one another. I can only speculate, but I imagine their alliance is uneasy and quite fragile. Let us hope that ours is less so. Don't suppose you have any idea what could be waiting for me inside the tomb? Considering a dark witch was involved, I suppose there's a chance you may encounter the dark protectors, known as Inferi. The foul creatures thrive on darkness and the cold. Vanquish them with light, force, and most effectively, fire. It all seems clear to me now that we're here. I do hope our alliance proves fruitful. Again, I wish you luck. I will remain here, eagerly awaiting your return. Please, be careful. Let's go in.
Revelio. It's sealed. Lumos. Moths. Curious. Rebellion. Merlin's beard. This can't be the witch's tomb. Likely I need to go further. Revelio. Lumos. Revelio. Lumos. This is gonna be the last one. Maybe I can blow it up. Confirm. Lumos. I have a feeling I'm not alone here. Wow. Inferi must be st struck with fire spells to make him vulnerable to other attacks. Incendio. Incendio. Confirmed. Arrest on the left. Incendio. Confirmed.
Lumos. Rebellion. Arrest on momentum. Rebellion. If I could power it somehow, it looks like it could be rotated. Rebellion. Yeah, if I got a power it somehow. Lumos. Risk. I can borrow one though. There we go. That works. Lumos. Closer. But how? Rebellion. What's that hanging there? Looks precarious. Down I go. No other way. It's sealed shut from the other side.
right, let's jump. Lumos. 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 This looks even more complex. Depulsor. Lumos. Now for the last one.
Lumos. Rebellion. Lumos. Wait a sec. Lumos. Accion. Making this spin ought to raise that platform. That must be it. Lumos. Rebellion. Lumos. Protego. Lumos. resting place. Lodgok said the helmet was in her sarcophagus. A dead Ashwinder. Your compatriots must have made off with the helmet. Lodgok won't like this. Better show this to Lodgok. Rebellion! Oh, there's a mechanism to open this door.
Lord Gok, the sarcophagus had been raided. I found no helmet, only a dead Ashwander. They got here first. We need to get it before Rookwood uses it to further ingratiate himself to Ranrock. I saw one of their campsites not far from here, but I fear you must go in alone. My fighting days are behind me. An entire camp of Rookwood's thieves. I might need assistance. Unfortunately, we have no time. Get to that helmet before Rookwood does, or we will lose our chance at any leverage, no matter how small, with Ranrock. To think those wretched thieves have their hands on such a relic. Lumos. Lumos. These rocks have seen better days. Perfect. Target practice. There they are, the Ashwinders. You will pay for that. Rookwoods don't go down easy. You've made a grave mistake. Oh, 
avoiding our problems, shall we? Levioso. <laughs> Nothing more than luck. Levioso. Expulso. You don't stand a chance against me. Levioso. Quite contained. I have so much of a scratch on me, but don't be sorry. Enough! That puts me down! Flash of inspiration! Repulsor! Incendio! Expulso! What are you folks on? Expulso! Might want to look up! Let me also. This isn't a bad trap. The culture. Yes. Expulsion. Potato. Stop that at once. Arrest the momentum. Expulsion. I quit now. Boy, you're still alive. Levioso, Lumos, Incendio. Expulso! Arresto momentum, Levioso. Incendio. Rebellion. That's it. This is for Rockwood! It's all finished. <laughs> Novice luck. Oh. 
Enjoy this. Revelio. Looks rather dark in there. Never stopped me before. I retrieved the helmet from the Ashwinders. Well done! This is sure to impress Ranrock. The helmet shines even more brightly than I imagined. The etchings, the contour of the profile, remarkable. It looks stunning, Lodgok. I see why you wanted it back. You did the thieves a service by recovering it. I know many a goblin who would have killed for it. Ah, then I am glad to be rid of it myself. Thank you. This should earn Ranrock's trust. I will take it to him immediately. It may distract him from his search. His search? It, uh, it is merely an inkling. You have impressed me greatly, friend. I am glad that I trusted you. We shall speak soon. Best to keep our arrangement quiet for now. Many will not believe that our aims might possibly be aligned. Hello, friend. I wonder if you might stop by the three broomsticks when you can. I would like your help with something. As I mentioned, my sister Anne misses Hogwarts, and she hasn't been herself lately. 
I'd like to take you up on your promise to visit her with me. I'm heading to Feldcroft soon, so I'll look forward to seeing you there. It's just south of Hogwarts. By the way, hope you're faring well with the blasting curse. It's still one of my favorites. Now that you've attended Beast's class, I've asked Deke to assist you in using the room <gasps> to further your studies in that regard. Please meet him there when you can. I've not heard from my Uncle Roland in quite some time. I've been beside myself with worry. Could you meet me in the courtyard? Revelio. Back to that top room and then save me. Cause I'm cause I'm going to bed. Cause I'll be going to bed now. Alohomora.
Alright, don't go up there. Seems that's off limits to me. It appears I won't be going up there. Hilarious stairs. That's all for now. Thank you for watching. This is Sutter Drops signing off. Have, have a good night, guys. Good night.